What's up guys, it's D-Night here coming at you another video. And I'm going to teach you guys how to play NBA 2K16 hours early. More than 10 hours early guys. As you see, I already got the pre-order edition right here downloaded. I cannot play it at this moment right now. I press A button on my Xbox controller. And just say, you are too early. I got to wait until the time date, you know, whatever, blah, 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 blah. And I'm going to go to the marketplace guys and show you guys something real quick, man. <coughs> And yeah, guys, 2010 graduation. <laughs> All right, guys, you see I got it right here. It's, I got to wait to play on the 29th, but that's not legit. Go down to this spot right here. You read this. It say it will not be a playable until 12.01 New Zealand time. As you guys see, I set my clock to New Zealand time. That's all you got to do. You read that real quick. New Zealand time, standard time, you know. 25th of this month. In New Zealand, it's like... And New Zealand's like the 24th right now. So it'll be tomorrow our time in America. And I'm going to go ahead and take you guys into it. You guys can press and go into my games and apps. Go into apps. Scroll all the way over, you know. Or you can press start on the home. Start on your controller. Go to settings. Easier way. Go to settings. Go to system. Uh, go to systems, guys. As you get into settings. And this is what you want to do. Set your time zone to New, to New Zealand. Not time zone, but location to New Zealand. Do not use your time zone. Time zone do not matter. Just do the location because it will ask you to reset your Xbox, as you can see right here. You can, uh, English, keep it like that. Change it to New Zealand. You can change it to uh, Israel, whatever. But New Zealand is the furthest time zone from America. It's 13 hours away from America, guys. You don't have to worry about that. And after you get finished changing your time zone, location, whatever, guys, you just go to reset game. I'm not gonna press on it right now. As you reset your game or reset your location to New Zealand, and your time zone will be in New Zealand time. And as you and like I, I like I invite you guys to pre-order the game before you change it to New Zealand time because the price will be higher. And for some reason, and you won't have your credit card on there or something, you know, if you're doing it off the dashboard. And we'll get this. Let me go back to the marketplace real quick, guys. I'm going to press on this and go to the marketplace real easily. And I'll take you guys to the marketplace. And you guys should see this. You guys should see this message right here. Oh, snap. <coughs> Loading real quick. All right. You guys should see this right here, guys. When it tells you you cannot play it until the 25th New Zealand time, 0 0.1. You know, 12 a.m. 12, 12.01 a.m. That's the time zone. You know, that's army time, if you guys didn't know, 20, uh, 20, hello. Thank, thank you, 24 hours. Yeah, that's 24 hour time zone, 24 hour time clock. I don't know how they say it, because we going to 12 hour, they going to 24 hour time clock. But anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video and found this video informational. Leave a like on the video, subscribe to my YouTube channel for further content, and I will be pumping out NBA 2K16 videos, pro-am, my team, online ranked matches, all the good stuff, you know. I'm going to try to do it all. Last year, I didn't do my team, but this year, I'm definitely going to do it and also do ranked matches. And anyway, guys, catch you guys in the next video. Peace.